you know, there's a sort of individual human aspect to this, each of us, right? Where, um, are we, you know, are we in harmony with the ambiguity that we're facing and the judgments that we're making against that role that we have? Um, and, you know, each time you get it right, then you have people who are feeling engaged and satisfied and all those good things that make organizations a lot more successful. And if you get it wrong, you get dysfunctional behavior. So it's like, at the human level, you want it to be right for individuals. But I think one of the things over time, working with Jillian and, and, and Bios, there's a design issue as well. There's an expectation. At this particular level of the organization, what are the sorts of people that you're liable to be able to recruit? What are the sort of pay levels that you're going to be able to pay? All right, that defines a broad area of expectation you can have about, you know, how much ambiguity can you push at them for them to make good judgments. You then need to design your organization so that then you're not expecting them to make judgments that sit outside that framework. Um, and I, you know, I think it's, you know, I think it's, it's really important and it's an aspect of, if you like, designing the organization for success that, you know, I think most organizations don't pay enough attention to. In fact, I think I know most organizations don't pay enough attention to.